research is showing that uh, we are ingesting plastic on a, on a daily basis. By intercepting trash before it makes its way into the bay, we are preventing microplastics from getting ingested by other animals and in turn by people. The San Francisco Estuary Institute, along with our close partner, the Southern California Coastal Water Research Project, has been funded by a public agency, the California Ocean Protection Council. Conventional trash assessments require a crew of up to 10 practitioners in the field. Practitioners are in the creeks, in the streams, identifying trash, classifying trash, counting it, weighing it. With a drone-based method, you're able to collect thousands of images and then feed that into a machine learning algorithm to detect the trash. Without Kinetica, the machine learning algorithm that would detect trash might take days. But with Kinetica, we are able to run the same detection methods in hours. When they run that model in Oracle Cloud, they're able to access what we call a GPU, a graphical processing unit. So this allows them to run the model inexpensively and very fast. Realizing AI's potential will not translate naturally to um, societal benefit. So we really need stakeholders such as companies, NGOs, governments to come together to shape the way we think about AI deployment and ensure that the outcome is what we want. We are at the forefront of action, but we have to be backed by the right information. And that's where institutions like SFEI come into place. Having a more systemic way of monitoring trash, that's a remarkable resource that cities, that different organizations can use. We do have the power to make positive change. We know that we can restore wetlands. We know that we can add urban greening features that can filter our water. It can really help our wildlife to thrive, our people to enjoy nature, and bring life back to areas which are otherwise barren. Particularly in the Bay Area, we have so many people who are willing to take action once they have information. But I think once we understand the impact, then we are, as a culture, willing to take bold moves.